Oh, it's a class four match representing Chinese Taipei, Ku Kunnan. And representing the Republic of Korea, Kim Jong-il. The umpire is David Edwards from Great Britain. And the assistant umpire is Ben Foote from Great Britain. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, more action. London 2012 Paralympic Games. First game, coach is served. Love all. Oh. Love. 
Hello again, this is Alison Bro, your in-ear commentator for this second game. 940 class four men's match. We have Ko in Chinese Taipei. And Kim from Korea, Ko in the purple shirt, him in the dark blue shirt, this is a class four men's wheelchair classification. All these men, there's 20 men in this tournament. Two seeds in the draw already through. The other 18 men are in groups of three. Kim is age 26, Korean player against 48-year-old Ko, Chinese Taipei. Four, five. Very even first game. Both men looking to try and get the wide angles. If you notice this is a class four game, which means they do, they are restricted in their lower limbs and some in their trunk, but they have full movement of their arms. They're quite happy to use their free arm. The arm not holding the racket to move the chair around. Try and position they position themselves in the center of the table, obviously. Try and play the ball in front of them with their backhand sides of the racket. The killer shot in these wheelchair games is the short one to the forehand or off the wide angle. They're not allowed to side off, serve off the side of the table. They must be seen to serve over the back line of the table. They can use whatever spins they like, fast, long, short, backspin, topspin, side spin, but the ball must be seen to be going forward. It cannot go off the side of the table on the serve. That's the only rule in wheelchair table tennis. First game quite comfortably for the Korean player, 11-5. This is the best of five encounter. So the first man to get three games will win the match. the Chinese Taipei player has a world ranking of 22 seeded 17 in this event Kim the Korean player in the dark blue shirt has a higher ranking of 9 And here we go for the second, second end. Second game, came to serve, love all. Uh, 
Okay, here we are in the second end. Close started off much better in this game. It's opened up a two point lead. 3-1. Korean just getting that one, so it's 2-3. The advantage of serve. Brings it level to 3-3. Three, three. moment they're playing mainly down the center of the table looking for the easier ball to play wide Korean coming right back into it now at 4-4 having won the first game quite comfortably 11-5 it's now built a one-point lead here. 5-4. Magic number, of course, is to get to 11. Men still playing down the centre of the table. No one prepared to open the angle of play. Finally, the Korean plays one wide to the forehand. It's now three points up, 7-4. Four. Just got that little bit more consistency, a little bit bigger range of shots. Twiddling the bat in his hand all the time. Taipei player still hanging in there, just the three points behind. Constantly rear engine moving his chair, getting himself comfortable. In well there for the short ball. But opened up that angle, allowing the Korean to get a bigger angle, which was impossible for him. So he's now 5 9 behind. Korea now 10 7 up, just one more point to give himself a 2 0 advantage, and that's 11, it. That's seven. the second game, second game. 11 7. Okay. Winning the first game, 11 5. Kim, age 26 from Korea. Yeah, has a world ranking of number nine in this class four men's event. Is seeded nine in the Paralympics here in London, 2012. He made his debut for Korea in 2007 in the Slovakian Open. And he states here his ambition is to have his own business. 
dream is to teach table tennis. And up against him today is Chinese Taipei opponent Ko, age 48, has a ranking of 22. These men are just part group. The other player being Martin Emmerich from France. Only one of these three players will go through to the knockout stages. So let's see how the Chinese Taipei man can get on in this third end. He's only managed five and seven points so far. Him lucky net there. Another lucky net, so that's two. He doesn't need this luck, the Korean player. Two, one. Two. Two. Taipei man now, 4-3 up. Again, a lot of the rallies are being played on the middle of the table. Eventually there, the ball was slightly higher. The Korean then going for cross-court backhand. His timing, absolutely excellent. Lots of top spinners, the ball flew across there. Another good rally by Kim, leveling the scores at 5 5. Just needs the one more game to put him. Through. Good serve there by Kim. The sky's top spin on the ball. Co not quite reading the amount of topspin, ball pops off the end. Ko doing so much better in this game, he's lost the first two, 11-5, 11-7. Commentator's nightmare as he serves off there. The timeout has been called.
Another great backhand there from Kim. Drilling that ball across court. You've had, he's just had too much for his Chinese Taipei opponent. So that's 10 6 now to register a 3 0 victory. Beautiful backhand, Kim. And there it is again. Wonderful performance by the Korean. 11-5, 11-7, 11-5. Just had a little bit too much for his Chinese Taipei opponent. This is Alison Bro signing off for this match.